Hello everyone, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is your daily read and it is for Wednesday the 29th of April 2020 for all signs. So as usual, it may or may not resonate with you. You decide what resonates and leave the rest. So I'm pulling a butterfly oracle card to start the reading. So what is the message? Ooh. We have memories. I'm gonna pull one more. What does that mean, please, angel spirits, guides, and memories? Thank you. Forgiveness from somebody from the past. Painful memories, maybe. It's time to release them. What are you holding on to? What do we have, Angel Spirits Guides? What is the message, please? People need to hear for Wednesday, the 29th of April 2020. Wednesday, the 29th of April. Yeah, third eye vision, reclaim your mind. Again, this is very much in line with this. Getting your head around a situation. Forgiveness is a form of release. Yeah. Discernment. Follow your intuition. Message from the angels. Allow yourself to be guided forward. And there's a nice message of getting perspective from something as well. Certainly with that third eye vision. It's quite instinctive too. Okay, let's see what we have. This is the Gilded Tarot by Marchetti. What do we have, please, Angel Spirits Guides? Message for Wednesday, the 29th of April 2020, please. Two of Swords, okay, Two of Swords, Page of Pentacles. Two of Pentacles. Seven of Swords. Ten of Swords. Too many, way too many, sorry. Thank you. I'm gonna shuffle a bit more. This deck in particular needs quite a bit of shuffling. More than the other decks, it's interesting. <laughs> what do we have, please, Angel Spirits Guides? Okay, thank you. Page of Cups and the Moon. Let's see, beautiful Ace of Pentacles, okay. Some of you are having a difficult time moving on from some deception, lies, somebody who wasn't truthful to you, somebody who probably wasn't what they seemed. Um, and it's almost kind of like you're stuck in the energy. It's holding you back. I'm certainly feeling that with these energies. And you need to really trust your inner instinct in order to see the way forward, to 
move on from whatever this situation is now. Now, there is a message of forgiveness here. Forgiveness is a form of release. It allows us to release, move forward. Forgiveness is more for our benefit than for somebody else's because it's how we just allow ourselves to make peace with the situation. We might not be happy about it, we might not forget in a hurry, but it does allow us to come to terms with the situation to the point where it doesn't hold us back. And I feel for some of you that's needed here in this situation. Because it's almost kind of like, you know, the pages are kind of a playful energy. It is, uh, it's almost kind of like a, an innocent energy of, of learning, you know, and this is the very first step on a new path. The pages are the beginnings of something new or the beginnings of change. And you're being told to to put your energies into something new, something that is going to bring you greater solidity, stability in your life, maybe in terms of money, security, foundation. It might be some of you might be looking at money opportunities um, to restabilize your life, to bring greater value into your life, you know, all of this kind of thing. It's doing the practical things that you need to do. Sometimes the page of pentacles can be about doing a qualification to get more money long term. Sometimes it can be about um, talking to, it can be about getting a promotion or a bonus, can be about uh, financial loans, you know, some news in terms of that respect. I, I just feel that this is about letting go of what's hurt you in the past, whatever the seven of swords was that had you flawed for a period of time. It's a 10. This is an ending. And this is the promise of, of a new beginning, but you need to take action toward this. This is about doing the practical things, focusing your practical skills, experience, knowledge, to bring greater abundance into your life long term. And why do I say the abundance? Because that's what the peacock represents. The peacock is a sign of abundance amongst other things saying that this is the first step towards a more abundant time for you. And there is a feeling, I don't always feel that, I mean some of you have gone through imbalance and I can feel this, um, and it's been difficult to re-stabilise and rebalance your life, you know, we have the moon in Libra, it's been a struggle to get balance, to get your head around a situation, it's been a struggle maybe to deal with your finances, or to get your physical world into balance. You need to trust your instincts now because you're being guided here. Even though you don't see the bigger picture, there is a message to trust your intuition. Because this is a card of hidden blessings and we had this yesterday. It is about trusting your instincts, surrendering the old. Some of you might have gone through an emotional time. It might have affected you mentally in terms of getting perspective in a situation as well. But this is absolutely trusting your instincts now towards a happier path. This could link to new love. This could link to more money as well. You know, Page of Cups can be a message of love. Um, or doing something that you love or just being ready to try out the new path slowly but surely just take that first step on a new path because there is a potential of a new path here focusing on what is of value in your life now and opening a new door to that route to that path now because this is a gift from the universe See, the sun is in the centre of this pentacle. And there is a message that you are being blessed at this time. You are being guided to open a new door now. And close the door on the past. Release the old memories. Because it's time. It's time to make new memories in your physical reality. 
that could be with somebody new you know the the, eight, the, eight, the ace of pentacles this can be to do with our money and career it is everything in our conscious reality that we build our lives around our money and career our homes our property our physical properties it can be to do with um, relationships that we build our life around it can also be to do with our health and this is opening a new door now a new path closing off the old and opening the new because it's time you're being guided to it what is a value in your life because it is time to intuitively take the first step towards it now and bring greater stability and security to your life powerful energies now the Ace of Pentacles can represent an opportunity, a golden opportunity that is guided to you. There may well be an opportunity coming your way, some message, because this is message and we have the page, page of Pentacles here. This could be something that is coming your way that brings a big turning point to your life. Don't hesitate to take it because it's guided. It is about trusting your intuition to open up to the new now. Don't hold yourself back. Don't self-sabotage. This may well be some kind of opportunity that is presenting itself to you. There could be some message coming your way. Um, like I said, a few days either side of the reading. Because, you know, this is Jupiter in Capricorn. Good things want to come into your life. But there's a need to find balance. Release what's gone in order to open up to it this is a golden opportunity the golden coin it's a blessing it's guided it's to do with your destiny the aces are all to do with your destiny yeah wish wisely nice use your wishes wisely to manifest your heart's desire and take practical steps towards making your dreams to come true take practical steps towards making your dreams come true now yeah lovely energy i hope you enjoyed the reading if you did please do like share and subscribe i hope it's a wonderful day for you and i will see you next time thank you